there is no button per se, though there is something called the football, um, which is not an actual football. So we'll just get rid of that. Let's say this is a unnamed future president. Uh, everywhere he goes, he's accompanied by a military officer who is 04 or above, major or above, <clears throat> as represented by this Hello Kitty. He holds with him the football, and he physically has it handcuffed to his uh, right paw, uh, pardon me, his left paw. That way, as you can see, he can always salute. Meow, meow. Good morning, Mr. President. The football is reporting for duty. Oh, okay. Glad you're here, football. Oh, I can't remember. What am I doing today? I can't remember. Well, it's not the football carrier's uh, decision what the president does all day long. He just follows the president everywhere the president goes, as seen here. So let's say an unnamed uh, Asian dictator who has nuclear weapons, as seen here, represented by Hargrid from the Harry Potter collection at uh, Burger King, I believe. Let's say Kim Jong-un launches uh, a nuclear weapon. Bluey, <laughs> the president's national security advisor, who's usually with him, goes clop. What? They do so? Give me the football. At this point, the president pulls out of the football uh, what's called the biscuit. At that point, the Secretary of Defense does know, has authenticated that indeed he is on the phone to the President of the United States. And the President of the United States says, by my authority under U.S. Code, Title 10, as the Commander-in-Chief of the United States military, uh, I am ordering you to execute Scenario 17A with the target being Pyongyang, North Korea. At that point, the Secretary of Defense says, Roger, Roger, and off he goes. In other words, what you just saw with the President and the Secretary of Defense was called the two-man rule. Uh, he authenticated to him, and this one has to agree. They both have to agree on what the authentication is. Bottom line here, there is no button, there's no way that this guy can just, whoever this future president might be, can simply become the president and suddenly, uh, like Slim Pickens in uh, Dr. Strangelove, go woo and ride the missile down. Anyway, that's the procedure for the button. Um, in, in sum, as you see, it's not an actual button, it's a process. And it's a process that has checks and balances along the way to uh, prevent some completely insane guy from uh, abusing it.